in this subtitle review i'm going to show you how you can create awesome social media videos that have captions borders headlines progress paths and support resizing hi my name is david and if this is your first time watching my video tutorials and you get value from the content that you watch kindly consider subscribing any links or links to subtitle i mentioned in this video are available in the links below so by the end of this video, we should be able to create a video like you see on screen, and it's pretty easy. So this application or the automated applications support headlines. This is just a custom headline here, and uh, you can also add captions. These are captions here. And uh, once you export your video, the captions are added as uh, open captions. Now, it also supports adding a progress bar and resizing your video for the different social media platforms, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, etc. You can also add a logo if you're in the... And the reason why this is important is because whenever you see a video on social media, let's say a place like Facebook, 80% of those videos don't have audio playing automatically. What if the videos had video captions available and more or less open captions which are permanently banned in the video? So what subtitle will help us with is creating all that including automatically generating subtitles from our video. So let's get started. And the first option we need to do is just sign up. We need to create an account. I'll just write my name and then enter email, uh, select that one and then enter our password and then sign up. Uh, once you click on sign up, uh, there we go. I'll just save this uh, so that I can just uh, have it available when I need it. So uh, this is uh, the first video that they have on here. You can edit it and see uh, what you have. What if I decide to add a new video? I can just click on add a new video. And uh, for this particular video, uh, you need to select the language. It is important that you follow this process because it's going to guide subtitle in terms of transcription and captioning. So my language or the video language is in English and this is your default language. And then you can drop a video file here or click uh, to select a file to upload. Since I already have a folder uh, with a particular uh, video, I'll just drag and drop it into the folder, uh, into the particular interface. And it's going to upload onto a uh, subtitle. Depending on the length of your video or the size uh, that is the MBs or GBs. This may take a long or a short time and also the strength of your internet connection. So if you have a long video or a huge file, then please bear with it as it takes some time. Let's give it a couple of seconds and I know it will be done. So there we have it. Uploading is at 100% and then we'll wait for it to extract audio tracks from a particular video and then it's going to start automatically transcribe our audio now. We need our audio transcribed into text. And once it's done, it gives you your video to your left with the option to edit the captions, style the video and download. So here's my video, it's just a talking head. Uh, the surroundings were just a green screen and I've just uh, edited it out so that we can just have uh, the talking head section here. It's loading here or buffering. And then we have our captions or the transcript on this, uh, on this particular section. So this is how it goes in this video. Then if you want to edit, just click inside. I uh, use the arrow keys to move to where you want to move. For example, I need to do a backspace and put in a comma. In this video, I'm going to show you how to take screenshots on your computer. So let's just listen through uh, and uh, get a feel of how it looks like. In this video, I'm going to show you how to take screenshots on your computer. This video, this in, this video includes some. So uh, those are just some mistakes. Just go back. I'm using the arrow key, holding down the shift key. And then we can press on delete. Uh, it's just going to cut out the transcript. It's not going to uh, cut out the video. So uh, that's okay. Uh, but basically, this is what it looks like. Uh, it seems there was a mistake there. So. Uh, there was a mistake in the video. Uh, let's say you've, you've already edited your video and everything is just adding the captions to the video. So uh, what we need now to do is just style the video. 
uh, this really depends on what you're looking for. For example, uh, you can see uh, the different options we have here. Focused headline. Uh, we've got uh, minimal captions. Uh, that has a white background. And then we have uh, outspoken captions. And then we've got uh, outspoken headline. That's pretty huge. So maybe we can go with, uh, let's say, minimal captions. Well, that looks good. You can also uh, change uh, the fonts and all that, but I'm not interested in that. Uh, let's say we're working with, let's say, a square. It changes your video to a square, uh, puts in your video there. That's awesome. Uh, so you can also fine tune position by adjusting this uh, particular captions where you want them. Uh, you can either uh, uh, right align them, left align or center align. I prefer them on the center. You can zoom, uh, that is on the video, to see what goes uh, through there. Uh, that looks good. And then to our right is the option to add a headline. Add a headline. Uh, by default, it picks the uh, title of the video. Uh, but you can just call it taking screenshots on your computer. Uh, you can now change the style. Um, let's say something like minimal captions. Uh, we can also decide to edit that so that let's say uh, we maybe change the background. Let's see if we can do that. Let's say background color. We go to something like red. Maybe something of a sort. That looks good. And then once you're satisfied, uh, if you wanted to change uh, the fonts and all that, you can do that. But let's just save and see what options we've got. So that's what we have. Just close and uh, both uh, this particular uh, caption style takes the red option. Doesn't look good, but really depends on what you're working with. Just style it uh, to your own uh, uh, liking. And then we can just do uh, a progress bar. And it's down here. Let's say we have the foreground. Uh huh. What about black? Yeah, that looks good. Not bad. Goes well with uh, the red. That's okay. If you have a logo, you can just add it here. So uh, that's just the basic styling of this particular video. Uh, and then once you're satisfied, uh, and also you can actually just make this uh, caps lock taking screenshots on your computer. There we go. That looks good. Uh, and once you're satisfied uh, with the results of your uh, video here, uh, all you can do is now go to the option to download. And uh, this, as they've mentioned, once you're satisfied with your video, you may click the button below to render and download the video with captions. When you render this video, one video will be redacted from the one video in your account balance, leaving you with zero videos. So this is a free uh, trial to test out how it works and also show you how it works. I'm sure I'll be getting uh, the paid version soon uh, since I think I can have some awesome use for this, especially when it comes to creating social media videos for clients. So let's just click on render and download. Let's continue. Please wait a moment. So uh, it's rendering. So we can view the transcript, we can download the SRT, or even have uh, the email, uh, an email sent to our email address. So those are the options we have. Let's just click on view transcript and we can see uh, our transcript. So if you wanted to uh, download the transcript, you can do that, copy it. Uh, if you're satisfied with what you've seen, just click on done. You can download the SRT subtitle and uh, by clicking on that it automatically starts downloading and if I click on it it's going to open up in notepad and you'll see the subtitle with the timestamps and all that so that's pretty awesome uh, so uh, we're back inside the subtitle it's still rendering our video really depends on the length of your video so if you have long videos uh, just know that it's going to take a longer time Social media videos are meant to be short and sweet. 
So if you want to create engaging content or even repurpose other videos, then create short videos with the highlights of the particular uh, points that you wanted. So it's almost done and uh, let's wait for it so that we can just download our video and see the final product that we have from Zubtitle. Now it's almost done uh, rendering. I just went back to my videos folder and it has this circle uh, just right here. It's almost done rendering the video. Not really sure how long it, it would take for a longer video because this was just a 26 second video uh, and it's potentially uh, taking about 15 minutes if I'm not mistaken. So uh, you need to know that depending on the length of your video, it may take a long or a short time. So not sure what it depends on, uh, maybe what options you have set, but uh, you may need to have it send you the rendered version to your email or something uh, because it's still rendering and uh, it seems to have like stopped it around this particular section. Uh, but I'll come back once it's done to see the results that we have. Once your video is done rendering, you'll get the option, uh, the ready to download inside my video section and you can just click on it. And once you click on it, and then you'll have the option to, uh, your video is complete, click here to download. You can just click here to download the video uh, and automatically it should just start downloading inside your browser. So. It's downloading, it's about 49 MB. And uh, this is awesome. Having the option to create awesome social media videos that have video captions, a progress bar, a headline is really, really awesome. And you can always resize the particular video that you're working on for the different platforms that you're working with. So this is really awesome. And this has been my subtitle review uh, using the free option inside subtitle and uh, as always uh, you can check out the pricing and the pricing uh, goes like this you only have one trial video and they don't need your credit card you've got almost all options available in the standard or the elite but you only have one video available uh, if you go for the standard 10 videos per month at about 19 dollars per month uh, depending on the pricing let's say we go with the monthly uh, the, the yearly is 120 videos per year and how much are you going to be charged? 190. So if you go for the elite 360 videos per year for about $490. So uh, that's about the pricing. And uh, if you're interested in checking it out, you can ch use my link below uh, to get this. So let's see the final result of the video. Just click on open file. In this video, I'm going to show you how to take screenshots on your computer. This video, this, in, this video includes some easy, free ways. Uh, so basically, that's it. That's how you can create excellent or awesome social media videos. This was not awesome, it's just a sample video. Uh, inside subtitle, export the file and use it on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, etc. I hope this video has been on value. And if you got any value from the content that you just watched, kindly consider subscribing liking the video and until next time stay safe and never stop learning thank you for watching